On Saturday, October 5th, the Benin State Independent Electoral Commission conducted local government council election that saw the election of new council chairman across the state. However, shortly after the elections, an online video surfaced alleging widespread rigging during the voting process. This video, which has been used to ridicule the government... In a joint press briefing at the government house in Makoldi, the Benin State Capital, the Chief Press Secretary to the Governor, Teso Kula, dismissed the video as an attempt by desperate individuals to discredit the elections. It is clear that the video is an obvious stage-managed drama orchestrated by those who seek to undermine the good governance of His Excellency, Reverend Father Heisen Yomemalia. We found no credible evidence linking this fabricated content the governor or his government. Kula further emphasized that the recently concluded polls marked a significant milestone in the state's council elections. This election marked a significant milestone as it was the first time in many years that voters in Benue had access to ballot papers for local government elections. This achievement should be celebrated rather than tarnished. We remain committed to transparency and accountability in governance and will not be deterred by attempts to mislead the public. Speaking at the briefing, the Secretary of the Benin State Independent Electoral Commission, Associate Professor Vincent Dassault, acknowledged that there were minor incidents of ballot box snatching in two local government areas during the voting process. In the course of the investigation, we contacted all the electoral officers across the 23 local governments of Benin State. Only in Vandikia, that one of our ballot papers, alongside, you know, the box is, is missing. Then also the incidents in Ushongu. So we have just two places where our materials are missing, and they're in the custody of the police. Therefore, the video will not have emanated from that source. And I can tell you categorically that the video is not from the commission. With both the Benin State government and the electoral body distancing themselves from the allegations in the video, there is the need for law enforcement agencies to investigate the authenticity of the video and the content therein.